Knits are here, y'all. I just got a package from Cotton. They're kindly sponsoring today's video. I think you guys are going to flip when you see these ones. This is probably my favorite cotton collection yet. Let's get into it. I'm also going to try everything on. The first pair of socks, very cozy. These are their Highland sweater socks. Very excited about these for boots. Okay, next we got a really nice soft long sleeve. This is just their fitted long sleeve in the marshmallow color. Looks like this. Very cutie. Let's put it on. Here's the fitted long sleeve in the marshmallow color. I have mine in an extra small. Really love the way it fits. I feel like could get a small, but I actually quite like this look. Okay, then we have the women's cable sweater in the moon color. How gorgeous is this? Like it's so beautiful so soft love me a cable knit i like that the sleeves are a little bit kind of balloon but not really the neckline is so pretty okay let's put this one on um okay obsessed with this perfect cable knit sweater i'm really happy i got a small i feel like i like how kind of like oversized it is but not too oversized it has a really nice like high collar I personally do not find it itchy, but you may. I don't know. I'm not very sensitive to wool. Button is crushing it. This is so cute. I'm really excited about this. It's a skirt. It's their fine knit skirt in the chestnut slash cashmere color. Look how cutie. I don't have a knit skirt, so this is very exciting for me. And it's really soft. I love the stripey detail of it. Okay, love, 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 love this skirt. I just put on the bare boots with this so you can get the full look, but how cute is this? Knit skirt. It doesn't feel too heavy though, so I feel like this would be really good for transition from like fall, summer, fall, fall, winter, because it's kind of lighter, so you can do like tights underneath or no tights underneath. I also think it would be really cute with a pair of sneakers. And I just, I love the color. The waistband's really nice. Okay, another hit. And then lastly, this is a men's sweater actually. This is the men's Kilimanjaro fuzzy sweater in the alabaster color, but I got it an extra small. And it's so cute. I love the color of it. It's kind of almost like slightly buttery oatmeal. It's really, really fuzzy. Like it has, I don't know. I don't know if you can see the knit, but it's kind of like... A melange of colors it's so beautiful I think this is the perfect fall sweater right I'm so impressed I love this so much can't wait to style it I actually might even wear it today but I feel like it might be too warm for today but oh it's so cute I love the color I love the neckline on it cotton you have outdone yourself I have a feeling I'll be living in this. Cotton's design team really is that girl. They really are. I have a code, as always. It's on the screen, Sarah Gray 15 Thank you, Cotton, again, for sponsoring today's video. You guys are gonna get sick of this sweater. Okay, I think this is how I'm gonna style this today. Vintage tee and some sneakers. I have so many errands for today. Holy smokes. What do we think? <sighs> My hair is kind of dirty. Oh well. But yeah, I have so many. also just got this new necklace from Chen Lu. Um, which I think is kind of cute with this. Um, okay. I need to get my bag together. This is what I settled on. <laughs> Maybe a little bit wacky, but it's comfy.
morning, good morning. I'm getting ready. My boyfriend and I are driving up to Cowichan today because it's Paige's birthday on Monday and she's having a little camping birthday. So I'm just getting ready to go. Most of my stuff is packed up. Just gotta load the car. Sarah thankfully is letting me borrow her car because I mentioned this in a patron vlog but my car broke down, so. Unfortunately, I don't have a car right now, but Sarah is away, so she's letting me use her car, which is amazing. Make some breakfast, get on the road. It's only, it's like less than two hours away, but we need to stop at the grocery store as well, so that'll add on a little bit of time. I don't know if it's gonna be super, super hot up there, but it'll definitely be warmer than it is here because it's away from the ocean and in the valley kind of so i've actually never been camping on couch and lake before so i'm very excited looks really beautiful and i know it's a very popular place to camp here man my skin is freaking out so badly i don't know what's going on my eggs got a minute left I'm gonna do some powder bronzer this has been my new thing i do my powder bronzer on top of my cream bronzer i don't know it's probably because i'm my tan is gone and I just want to look as tan as possible also my hair is like in that length right now where it does a little zoop. usually i just let it air dry and then i'll go in well sometimes i'll do it before like while my hair is still wet but i'll go in and like blow dry my bangs with a round brush but Usually I'll just let it air dry first and then do that after. I don't know, I'm just having one of those phases where I don't like the way my makeup looks. And I know you know what I'm talking about, you know, like you haven't changed anything, but for some reason it's just not hitting the same as it used to. I also decided to fill in my brows just with the pencil in the front, like a tiny bit because Trying to just get used to doing no brows. Maybe I'm getting a little bit tired of filling them in, if I'm going to be honest with y'all. Maybe some lip balm. The road one is the one that I keep. Oh god. Hold on, my egg is done. The road one is just the one I keep in my makeup bag, so a tiny bit of that. Okay, that's it for makeup.
Tuesday today. Things have not been particularly exciting for me. I've been sitting at my computer most days, so I haven't vlogged a ton through the last 48 hours. It's a lot of this, it's a lot of this, and a lot of this, you know? So, not very exciting. I have a couple bigger things to do today, um, mostly just content that I need to make. It's actually very gloomy and rainy cozy day hence the sweater i am so obsessed with this if you are a little bit sensitive to wool this neck might bug you a little bit i am still loving my hair if you're curious it definitely needs a little bit of a shaping again i think just like around my face to kind of even out these heavier pieces so yeah not much to update but i'm so happy you're here I would love it if you gave this video a like if you liked it because that really helps me out here i'm very excited for my move that's one of my big to-do list things today is i need to do quite a bit of packing i am moving all of my stuff in five days five days no yeah on sunday okay getting back to work now i've also not been wearing my gold hoops i really want to get a pair of silver hoops i do love my gold hoops still don't get me wrong but I'm feeling, you know, just as the seasons are changing, so am I. So I kind of want to give silver hoops a try, but I don't know where to get any, like, good ones. So maybe I'll go to a jewelry store today. I don't know. I don't have any. I thought I would, but I don't have any. I just got back from running some errands. I had to pick up a package. I'm still wearing this cotton <laughs> um, top, but... I need some love stuff. This is my favorite recently. The squirt um, gloss, squirt plumping gloss stick or whatever in number 19 from MAC. And I went to Sephora. Actually, first I went to the Bay and got a pair of earrings because I just said I wanted to get some silver earrings. So I did just that. Got a pair of sterling silver hoops. She cleaned them there, FYI. I don't know. I'm just going to play around with some silver for a little bit. I really like mixing metals, so I don't mind when, that it's mixed with my gold. What do we think? Okay, I got three things from Sephora. Two of them are brushes, which is kind of random because I never really go for brushes, but I got this Hourglass Vanish Concealer Brush because I've been into applying my concealer with a brush. And this one looked really nice. Uh feels really nice looks like this so I got that and then I got I guess I'll show you the other brush I got I got the Tarte I guess this is their, this is their foundation brush but I really want it for bronzer seems like a great bronzer and like a cream bronzer brush and I also just like how small it is I'm really I like flat bottom brushes the Sephora collection ones I like, but they have points at the end, and I don't know why that really bugs me. Also, my car is still in the shop, so I bust there, which was fun. It's supposed to be done by the end of this week, thankfully. And then I got the YSL under eye concealer. I feel like I've been wanting this since I was probably like 15 or whatever. I started watching YouTube videos of people doing their makeup. So I finally got it. I got mine in shade 2.5, which seemed like the right shade so I've been really itching for a new under eye concealer I use the RMS one but I don't love it I think it's like a tiny bit too drying almost even though it's coconut oil I don't know so I'm excited about this and this combo and a little bit of this I was feeling some type of way earlier and I tried to fix my problem now it is time to make lunch I'm just gonna make some noodles and get back to work aka computer work
yoga. Well, no, yeah, I'm warming up my car. But I got my car back, it's fixed, except someone stole my freaking roof racks while I was parked at the mechanic, which is obviously very frustrating, but you know what, hey, they probably needed them more than I did. So, nonetheless, I'm happy to have my car back. I get so sweaty in this class now. It's the hottest temperature they offer. It's like 38 degrees, I think. 38 or 40, I think it's 38. Why is my lighting being like this? I am drenched, and I never used to get this sweaty. I mean, it feels good, but like doc why are you sweating so much this is the align tank i really don't like it for obvious reasons it's just like is not i don't know i like the ones that are a little bit more high neck for the little lemon tops but i didn't know that when i bought it i should have done some more research Whew. okay i need to go home shower get my day started